Hello everyone, welcome to Wrath of Math, I'm your host Sean E, and in today's video we're going to be going over what is a Sikiri quadrilateral. So a Sikiri quadrilateral is of course a quadrilateral, so we got four sides, with two congruent legs that are perpendicular to the base. So this side, or leg, is congruent to this side, or leg, and they're both perpendicular to the base. Now, a Sikiri quadrilateral will often, uh, you'll see it drawn something like this, um, with the, the angles at the top, which are called the summit angles, being kind of curvy, um, because you don't know what they are, uh, what those angles are. You know that these uh, base angles are both 90 degrees, however, um, the measure of these two summit angles, this one and this one, um, depends on what geometry you're in. Now, there's a theorem, this isn't by definition of the shape, but it is pretty easily provable. Um, these two angles are both congruent, um, but like I said, their measure depends on the geometry you're in. So if you're in Euclidean geometry, which is the basic geometry that a high school geometry class would be in, these two summit angles are right angles, and thus a Sikiri uh, quadrilateral is a rectangle, because those summit angles would be right, and then by virtue of the definition of the shape, um, those base angles are right, so now you've got a rectangle. But if you uh, have a Sikiri quadrilateral in hyperbolic geometry, for example, your uh, summit angles are going to be, I don't know what I'm doing there, your summit angles are going to be less than 90 degrees, so it'll look something like that. And of course, these uh, the summit and the base could be as long as you please, you're not usually looking at a, a shape that looks quite like that. But, so that side is congruent to that side, the base angles are congruent, and then these two angles would both be acute and uh, hyperbolic. So it depends on the geometry you're in, but that's the definition of a Sikiri quadrilateral. You know, they look something like that, generically. You don't know exactly what they look like. Again, it depends on the world, but that's what it is. It's got two congruent sides that are both perpendicular to a base. This is the base. This is a summit. Those are the summit angles. I didn't mean to make that look like a right angle. Those are summit angles, which are congruent to each other, and then these are the legs. So I hope that helped. Let me know if you want anything clarified in the comments. Let me know if you've got any other math questions, and be sure to subscribe for the swankiest math videos on the internet. Thanks for watching.